What's up guys? Toast again from Fish Yacker. For those wondering, I'm still working on the Express Jet Boat Project. Doing a lot of work. Uh, thought I would show you one little hack that can really come in handy that I am uh, essentially adapting from the kayaks. Let's take a look. So guys, on the passenger side gunnel, I've attached three pole holders, as you can see here, and this long thing attached to it, especially you kayak guys, you guys recognize that. Back in the day, we used to call these Cajun toothpicks. This is a Yak Attack Park and Pole Link. Obviously, it's a stakeout pole. This one's for Yak Attack. But the link is a perfect concept for using on a river boat, especially a jet like this, because you can make it into multi-pieces. Uh, you can take it and have a shorter version, and you can put links, again, hence the name, into the center of it. So uh, as you see here, I got the top and bottom piece with a center section in it. And I can actually, when I'm out on the river, I don't want to destroy the trolling motor, I can use this as a pole. I can go poling with it. It's got a nice cushion grip up at the top. It's got a handle you can grab it at the top. And just like I do on the kayaks, and a lot of the guys down south back home or in the flats and stuff also use similar devices in their boats, not just kayaks. But I've actually made out of an uh, original version with some uh, modern parts on it, some Yak Attack pieces, and actually made a stakeout pole mount there off the bow. So I can simply pull the trolling motor up. I can pull me into place. And I can simply stick it right there through that uh, kind of jerry-rig <laughs> uh, Yak Attack Zuka tube, your original Zuka tube with some modern parts on it from Yak Attack. But there you go. And of course, you can purchase these directly off of uh, Yak Attack's website. I'll put some links down below in the description too. But a uh, multi purpose device, you can use it on your kayaks, use it on your boats, use it for poling, use it for staking out and anchoring, shallow water anchoring. You can get the uh, holders also. You can get some of those directly from Yak Attack, or you can order, you know, other ones. I mean, if you have them sitting around like I did, uh, as long as they fit. But, uh, yeah, so that's how I actually pole with the boat, and I've actually gotten it down a number of times and used it. I can use that to pole in shallow, get up uh, below some rapids, and use it to hold myself in place without destroying the trolling motor. Like I said, I had to put some links down below. It's clean. Holds in place great, whether it's on the boat or in the water. And uh, I already had it from the kayak. And again, it's a Yak Attack Park and Pole, and you want to get the uh, longer options and have it uh, scalable, you can get the link. All right, guys, if you haven't yet, be sure to share this video on all your social media outlets. Give us that thumbs up. Subscribe to the Fish Yak or YouTube channel. And we'll catch you on the water. Fishyacker.com, the original kayak rigging video series.